Hello. It's been a while since I vlogged, um, because of, obviously, what I've said before, the whole internet connection thing at home. It doesn't work. But I've been visiting my brother off and on for the last couple weeks, um, and I spent the whole weekend, uh, Friday through today, I've worked one more day, um, to actually with him and one of his friends. Because um, last week we found out some really bad news in our family. Um, it started off on Tuesday. I found out that my dad's uncle had passed away. And uh, so we had the funeral on Friday, which is why I came over here after. Um, and while we were at the funeral for him, we found out that my dad's aunt passed away on Thursday. So, yeah, <laughs> it's not a very lucky time for us right now. Um, we've had a lot of death happen, and it was just a little weird because uh, while we were at the funeral, my Aunt Ruth actually had sent flowers for my Uncle Carl's funeral. So she knew he passed, and then sent the flowers, and then she passed away. So that was kind of creepy. Um, while we were there as well, my dad called his brother, my actual uncle, and told him about my great aunt Ruth. And he was joking in a way, kind of like, oh, you know, it comes in threes, so it's either going to be you or I next. Mind you, I've never met this guy in my life, and I've wanted to meet him, I want to meet him sometime this year, but I don't want to meet him at his funeral. And, uh, there's no way I'm ready to let my dad go anytime soon. So, it better not happen in threes, because, uh, yeah. I don't know, but right after that phone call, and after those words were said, the phone rang at the funeral home. So I was like, don't answer that call. It could be somebody saying, you're next. Do not answer the phone. So nobody picked up the phone, but it rang like two or three different times. It was just really creepy, especially after that moment. So, yeah, it was kind of strange. Um, after, I broke down a couple times, like, I ended up crying because I can handle one death at a time. Once every three years, it's still bad enough, but it sucks. it's not as bad as two. So I was sitting there, I was like, okay, Uncle Carl passed away. I can get over that a little bit. But then when I found out about my Aunt Ruth as well, even though I wasn't close to either one of them, it's just the fact that they're dying simultaneously right next to each other. And uh, I broke down and I was like, we're already losing family left and right. There's really not very many donishes in the world that are living in America that I know are related to me. Um, so it's kind of, kind of strange. But, uh, yeah. So I broke down from that and I finally composed myself. We went in and they started the service um, at 3 o'clock. And uh, I was doing fine in the service. I sat by my dad. Um, I didn't really want to leave the side because everything that was going on. Um, and I was perfectly fine until they started going through the obituary and then listing off everybody that had passed before. So, like, I heard my Uncle Howie, my Uncle Wayne, my grandpa, and then a whole bunch of other lists that were on that paper, on that obituary, that had passed. And then they added my roof into it, and I could not control my emotions at that point. I could not. I, I was a mess. Um, but, came back over to my brother's afterwards, after we dropped my little brother off, and his fiance off at her parents' place. Um, and we grabbed something to eat. But then we came back and I started visiting with my brother and we had our friend Brandon come over um, to help cheer me up a little bit. He ended up spending the night. It was very unplanned. We were watching a social network and he passed out on the couch because he was busy all day because he was tired. So he ended up just staying the night and then we hung out a little bit on the next day, yesterday. So it was nice. Um, you know, 
also got to go to a party last night, like a birthday party, but I wasn't my usual self, so like, I, I, didn't, I wasn't allowing myself to have as much fun because of all the funerals and some stuff going on in my head, and then I got a headache, and it just wasn't the night for me to be out, but yeah, other than that, everything else is perfect in life, like, well not perfect, you know, there's always going to be little hiccups here and there, but like, 2011 has been great for me, minus this last week. So, I'm hoping that this week is a lot better. Um, you will notice from my brother's channel that I have appeared in a few videos. Um, he wanted to do videos while I was here when I came to visit a few times. So, I'm going to do some video shooting footage and stuff. So, you can look at that. I will provide the link to his, his page in the description where I'm, I'm happy to put it these days because it used to be over here, not over here, not, then it was down there, then it was up there, I, I don't know where it is no more. But um, anyway, I hope everybody is having a good year and try to stay warm as much as possible. And not be stuck inside because of darn blizzards, but I will talk to you later whenever I'm able to mix. Peace.